Jesse Sanders, owner and chief veterinarian of Aquatic Veterinary Services. Today we will be talking about freshwater fish flukes. So this is a very common parasite that we see. It's actually technically a monogenean trematode, which is a very, very tiny little flatworm. And there's two species or genuses that we see more commonly than others. And this is Dactylogyrus and Gyrodactylus. I know, real, real original names, just switching them. Um, it's always been thought that Dactylogyrus likes to hang out on the gills and Gyrodactylus likes to hang out on the skin, but I've seen them jumping all over the place. They don't really read the, read the textbooks. Now, big issue with these guys is whenever they kind of settle on a piece of skin, sometimes they have these big claws and little suckers, and basically what they're going to do is kind of rasp at the skin in that localized area, makes them a happy little lunch. And, you know, fish has a couple of these, just like we said in our Parasite 101 video. Um, a few of them, not really going to irritate the fish. You really can't sterilize the outside of a fish, so they're going to have a couple ride-alongs. Um, it's really when these little flatworms start replicating again and again and again, then you're going to have some issues. Fish gets really irritated, um, especially if it's on the gills, you can have problems breathing. So... The biggest issue with this parasite is it's not susceptible to a lot of the other parasite treatments. So very important if you are seeing any signs of parasites in your fish, again the flashing, lethargy, decreased appetite, you just recently added some new fish, uh, that's the time to call your veterinarian. They will do their diagnostics, be able to determine what species you're dealing with and prescribe an effective treatment. So again, that's just kind of the deal with most parasites, but for the flukes, the monogenians, uh, really important that those are diagnosed properly so you know exactly what to treat with. So hope you little, learned a little thing, something about our little tiny flatworm friends. Um, if you have any other questions or looking for more information on fish health, please visit our website at cafishvet.com. At Aquatic Veterinary Services, fish are treated like family.